Hello and welcome back to another Matchday vlog. This is Matchday vlog number three of the 23-24 season. But it's the first game of the season for us and we play St Mirren, which is, I think it's the same team from Thursday night. I'll just get Paul. Can you get me the line up? Oh. It's the line up. I'll just get the line up for you. So the line up is Marshall, DeFerry, Fish, Hanlon, Stevenson, Doyle Hayes, Newell, Boyle, Campbell, Yoan and Doig up front, I mean, only having one up front is a bit, a bit poor, uh, I would have two up front, but I'm going to go for a 3-0 Hibs win, and Doig has scored four, but I'll get back into his, and they'll lead up to kick off.
the corner to meet them. Mirren due to a penalty that I think it was new or I can't remember what player flipped the ball away from the St Mirren man inside the box but it took about 10, 5, 10 minutes but the referee to decide it was a fucking penalty Fuck off! Turn out St Mirren That's the way. What he said, Pete.
Like, no, my review. Overall review is that game yesterday. I think I'm saying this on behalf of a majority of the Hibs fans. We didn't play well first half. Definitely not. Not to the standards that we know that we can set. <laughs> uh, obviously Marshall didn't look fit himself. Um, I think not after. I think he got clattered. <laughs> um, we we deserve to be two 0 down. There's no getting away from that. We we didn't deserve that. To be we were shocking in the first half. Too many long balls. Too many back passes. Too many not enough runs. And when we did get into areas where we looked like we could cause a wee bit. Trouble, nothing. Nothing in that final part in the first half. Now, look, eh, uh, I thought some of the young boys, eh, not young boys, I thought <laughs> Del Perry had a good game, I thought there was a couple of players that, you know, that done well. Um, before I carry on, I see a lot of criticism for Hanlon and Stevenson. Now, I don't know why they always get slated. Um, but if they weren't good enough for this team, or, sorry, should I say, if they were the players that everyone wants them to be, they wouldn't be at this club. Now, every manager, I think Stevenson's playing in his 19th or 20th season for the club, he's the only man to win two cups. So, but I thought, second half, I thought we were a, a lot more better, we were a lot more threatening going forward. We obviously got the two goals that we needed, and we generally looked like we were going to score uh, the winner, but we got caught out um, on the break, and there's nothing... Uh, Marshall could do about the goal. It was a well-struck goal. And, yeah, to get beat in a first league game, it's, it's annoying. It's definitely annoying. It's gotten... I, I just think... Uh, it's, it's really hard to put in towards... Uh, as to how we'll, well, we, Simon and obviously score more goals than us. But to come back from 2 0 down, to have a chance to score. But yeah, um, their first goal, never a penalty. Now, I am sorry, but the referee looked straight at this Mirren boy. Played on. Now, if he's to have a listen to bar whether or they're needing to check it, the play should be stopped. But it wasn't. It was played on. So why is it took what ten minutes after the fouls happened to then for the ref to go to the monitor to then give them a a penalty? It's, Oh, it's outrageous. Bar is probably killing. Bar is 1,000% killing football at this stage. Inconsistency refereeing. 
inconsistency with VAR, it's a shambles. But look, we've got a busy week ahead. Obviously, and it's our first leg in the third qualifying round at Easter Road, and then we're away to Motherwell on the Sunday. Um, you know what? As Hibs fans, we need to stick together. We need to believe in the team. And you know what? There's always... We've never done it the easy way, okay? We've never. Now, I've been a Hibs fan for... Since I was growing up, basically. So, say 26, 27 years. I've been a Hibs supporter. I've seen loads, but you know what? Credit where credit's due. Second half, a lot more positive. Now, we should have started the second half the way we... We should have started the first half the way we started that second half. But, look, if you do enjoy these match day vlogs and you want me to continue them, please hit the like button. Please comment and please share. Um, share the video and subscribe as well. Thank you. I will see you. I'm in two minds whether to do one on Thursday just because. I won't probably won't get that on until the Friday like afternoon tea time. And the same way, the one on Sunday probably won't get that out until Monday afternoon, Monday night. But I probably will do a vlog of some sort on Thursday, but I will catch you in the next.